Just in at 11, a strong message about our water. Brevard County Schools says it needs more answers to ensure it's safe. News 6's Eric Sandoval joins us now along the coast with their concerns and how they plan to move forward. Brevard schools already determined their drinking water is safe. The issue tonight was the water they use on their sports fields and their vegetation. They want the state to help them determine if the water they use on this is indeed safe. There's a lot of concern. And Brevard County School Board member Tina Desevich says she got even more concerned when she found out the water used for vegetation on school grounds contained trace amounts of possible cancer-causing chemicals. She said she turned to Tallahassee to see if it was safe to use. The state came back and said, yes, it's okay because you have low levels. Um, kind of a big statement. Tonight, Desevich looked to get results. The school board decided to get together with the cities of Cocoa Beach and Satellite Beach and Brevard County to draft a letter to regulators. They're asking them not to just set guidelines for what's safe, but to follow what they say other states have done and set actual limits. The move comes the same day the city of Cocoa Beach grabbed more samples of reclaimed water and sewage water. The next step for the city is additional testing, which we hope to complete in the next two weeks. City Manager Jim McKnight spoke to our news partner Florida Today and these pictures captured workers conducting more of those tests, checking for chemicals linked to a possible cancer cluster in southern Brevard County. The hope is, he says, to have those results back in about a month. In Brevard County, Eric Sandoval, News 6.